Ik warte niet gerne. Nazi subdirectors you know kennen. This isn't real. I told you to back away from this case. Take the gun. Why? Take the gun, Mulder. Trust no one, Agent Mulder. What am I supposed to Ooh, do? Dizzy. Kill him. Kill him, Agent Mulder. So helpless. To know that I can pull this trigger. I'm the reason you're alive, Fox. But while I hold this power, you'll learn that there is still a greater one. A power I need you to destroy. Now, kill him. Well, I need to destroy you, but... Oh, here we go. Now, you know, it's bad enough having to put up with Skin Man, but secret hunt, annoying hunchback she-devil of the SS, as Smoothie says, um, she's got the AK-47, and as we know, AK-47s are rather painful. How I'm supposed to beat both of them at the same time, I don't know. Especially when my auto-aim automatically goes on Skinner when I want to kill the bitch first. She's down. Yeah, I got the AK. But actually, Skinner's not too bad, to, not too hard to beat. There, that's for that audit. That's for being a too sexy. That's for being unavailable. That's for not giving us a better office. That's for not. I don't know. That's for looking scully all the time. Down there. That's that's just for being my boss. <laughs> People, we are getting to beat the crap out of Skin Man. How awesome is that? Sad at the same time. I mean, it is a Nazi Skin Man. I should have put a, a, a warning at the start. If you are currently under the influence or drunk, please do not watch this Let's Play. Mind you, maybe if you're high is the only time you can actually make sense of what's coming on. Well, at least I didn't die. You could change. Oh, I'm back. I love the uh, little Samantha picture on the table. Such detail. Uh, no, because I'm pretty sure I'm near the end of this. Hey, big guy. You feel any better? Mulder, you don't look well. You're infected. I need you to get in bed and lie down. We were able to find oh, yeah. a direct link between Rausch Biotechnologies and the alien conspiracy. They're following a script right out of Plan 9 from outer space. Speaking of Plan what 9, I'm still not convinced actual. Edward's death wasn't political assassination. Of course, the dude knew way too much. Anyway, we were able to backtrace the digital data to its point of origin, and we reached a server containing files as far back as 1947, the Aurora Project. It's Roswell. We don't need to tell you that. It's every answer to every question we ever dreamed of. What's wrong, Mulder? We thought you'd be stoked. Mulder, I need to give you this injection. Um, do not trust this woman, people. Bear in mind, she was trying to shoot us earlier. Mulder, you're sick. Let me do this. And bear in mind, look at the... Mulder? Uh, <laughs> it's not safe to say. Mulder, come here. I want to put you to bed. Ever, if ever you thought Scully was creepy, now will be the time. You are not allowed under any circumstances, and I'm only not letting her do it to uh, to show you because I didn't save rather stupidly. Um, she cannot get you near you with that injector. Die.
Welcome to Silent Hill. The Plastic Edition. Oh, I just figured! I was saying about the artwork before. That must be Boston. Oh, wait, look at the doors! I didn't know we'd entered Prince of Persia. We're going to Castlevania. To where you came, you are the pawn of a devil. <laughs> Resist or serve. You have found me, and I'll tell you the joke about that in a minute. Um, basically, uh, on the trailer, uh, there's a guy coming up. Um, and basically, he. Uh, on the trailer, Mulder said, oh, what was it? I don't know where I am, or something like that. And then this guy, this bearded guy comes on and goes, You have fooled me! And, and that was the main thing that was used in all of the trailers in the lead up. And me and my sister, we used to joke about it, because it was just the key line. So we used to just go around going, You have fooled me! Sounds really sad when I explain it now. But at the time, it, it was just that, that kind of thing. One of those moments that you, you just couldn't resist doing it. And especially when lines like that are used out of context, you, you have to fill in the blanks yourself. What you moved is this. You are not a disciple. You are not here to serve Jeremy me. Beadle. I can hear you. You're an assassin. What is this place? Your mind turning in on itself. You have found me. The same way I speak to the angels. The angels who will join me to deliver the last judgment, the day of reckoning. You have found me! Yes! <laughs> um. Oh yeah, Mulder is definitely finally Holy shit! Oh, what the hell? out of his mouth. Uh. Guess what I can say. Please let me out! Please! Oh, shit. Oh, what? 
What is that? What? what did you inject me with? Agent Mulder, you're hurting me. It's a shot to help you. Against the radiation I was to die? you. Marita, how did you know? After reading That's the data, Marita? you sent me, I knew you were possibly in danger. Then it's true. The it's artifact really, uh, is alien. Emitting a no, cosmic galactic radiation me. level strong enough to kill That's... us. That's... I have to call Scully. I did as you asked. I arranged travel for you on a Russian transport plane. If you're going to leave for Tunguska, it must be tonight. What? Scully. Scully, it's Mulder. Mulder, thank God. I need to see you as soon as possible. Our it's nervous like systems are producing a substance needle. akin to tetrodotoxin at lethal levels. Due to exposure to radiation, the CGR that emanated from the alien artifact. You know? How? I'm here with Marita Kovarubias. She gave me an injection to counteract the toxin. Are you all right, Scully? Yes. I caught it in time. What is Marita Kovarubias doing there? I asked for her help. She's arranged passage for me to Russia, Tunguska. I have reason to believe the artifact has been returned there, but I don't know for how long. Mulder, I'm here with the gunman. I think they have a lead on this Rausch Biotech Corporation. Do you think it's a good idea to be jetting off to Russia based on what? You have to trust me on this, Scully. Find what you can from Rausch Biotech, but I have to go. I am so bored. I'm sure I should go to Tunguska. What is up with... And that's the end of this chapter, folks. Ooh, we got some more c concept work. Oh uh, yeah, I guess I should save in a minute. <laughs> Tina's going going straight on to seven uh, X nine nine reckoning, the final. Episode as they call it in uh, this bloody game. Отдыхай, мы тебе поможем. Не бойся. Yeah, whatever. American. I don't speak Russian. Of course, Mr. Mulder. Well, why did you speak Russian? You to were me? pulled from the wreckage of Russian plane. We have taken care of you. Thank you for your help, but I have I have to go. You have my gun. I'm going to the camp. You need protection. I know about the tests. I know exactly what goes on there. Then you know what must How be done. How did you know he was going to the camp? No arm, no test. No, 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 no. The smallpox scar is some kind of identification tag. You don't have to do this. Removing the arm does nothing. Мы спасаем тебе жизнь. And again, we get the love. actually changed the uh, tagline to resist or serve. I, I didn't <laughs> I, I, I can't remember if they changed it on the second episode. It doesn't really matter. But I have to check that in place. Please don't chop off my arm. Please no. Oh. Stop everything. I love how easy it is to get under barbed wire. <laughs> kind of defies the point of having it there, but you know. to have a cabin just to house a first aid kit but there you go 